Hi everyone, this is Dawn with DEK Designs and today we are going to do a plan with me and my Hobonichi cousin for the weekly overview for the week of January 31st through February 6th and if that's something that you're interested in, please stay tuned. Okay, so I have done a few things since um, I last recorded to my Hobonichi um, when I kind of had the energy over the week when I was um, sick. So um, I put some of the sub box items in. I put, um, I cut this paper and that doily. I put one of the die cuts here. I haven't gotten too far, but I did put a cover on my two journals that are in front here. I used this paper and this paper. I really like how it turned out. So those are for my uh, notes and lists and stuff. And then I did cover that green. That was the cover of the Hobonichi. Um, but I haven't gotten any farther. Um, I haven't done this page. I'm probably going to do some of our DEK washi on this page. Um, but I did make these um, stickers <clears throat> last week for myself when I was um, sick and I felt like getting up out of bed or off the recliner. Um, and by request, I will be adding these to the shop. So this is our standard color palette that we use like in for our Emma girls and for Boo Bear. Um, it's kind of a neutral um, grays and tans and then the pink. A lot of planner girls use pink and the light lavender. So this will be coming to the shop. Um, so I have that done and then I need to design something for this. Last year I just left it like it is, but I want to be more functional with these. Um, so I think I'll make, um, month covers for this and maybe dates, strips that fit down here. Um with foil, of course. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I just, I think that's going to take a while to, to format with the spacing and all that, but, um, and maybe not do it in, um, well, anyway, yeah. So let me know if you have any suggestions, what you would like to see stickers for this page, what you use this page for. I was just going to track like our um, social media, um, excuse me, numbers up here. Um, and then I'm going to go back plan December just because I don't want to leave it blank. Um, I did do January and I am going to do February this week. So I'll film that for you guys. Um, and then I was going to show you that week that I didn't film because I used the box kit and I'm hoping this is all in frame here. Um, maybe I need to come up a little bit more. I don't know if that's better. Um, so it was, um, the week of January 17th through the 23rd and I used the box kit and I just had fun with it. You know, the box kit, um, the only size variation on our, I, should, I shouldn't say box because it doesn't come in a box anymore, but I can't change the heading on, on our website because then it'll mess up the whole renewal system. But on our monthly subscription, um, I used this the week that um, 
we were sending it out. Did we send it out that week? Yeah, box shipping day. I like to use it the week that we send it out. I'm just, I'm because I'm just excited for you guys to get it. And but the stickers um, are all the same size. The only thing that changes in the subscription is the monthly, and that is size to fit your planner. Otherwise, these are standard vertical boxes that one and a half wide, so they would overlap in the weekly. They work perfect, and I'll show you for your dailies. So I just kind of did a brief um, overview, and I just kind of tilted the boxes to give it a different look, and I'm really happy with how it came out. And then um, this is the week I was sick. This is um, this week. I, well, I'm filming this on um, Sunday the 30th, so. Um, you can see it, it's pretty um, blank. Nope, I didn't do my nails. We had no hump day. Um, <coughs> excuse me, um, I did do a few things. I hopped on the computer here and there and I did some settings in Shopify and we did oh Friday I need to write that down. We opened the sub spots. There's actually a few spots left. I think we'll pro probably sell out today. Um, so I'm going to mark that because it was at noon. Um, but other than that, I didn't get the 1099s done. That's going to carry over to this week's. Actually, they're due Monday, so I have to get them done tonight. Um, maybe when all the football games are on. So, um, this is um, last week. I, I, I like to check. Uh, like this week, I like to put down in that I didn't do it that week but I like to put down how my day was how I'm feeling how my mood was so I kind of track that there um I'm sorry I'm babbling on let's get to planning this week and we can chat a little bit about the COVID and it was really strange so um I'm going to use the kit. I'm sorry. This is the Hobonichi kit reset. And I thought it was a great kind of kit for this week because we are kind of resetting. Uh, we'll be doing a lot of, <coughs> excuse me, a lot of uh, catching up this week. And our customers are so wonderful. I'm so thankful for all of you you just made me smile with every comment and it was just so gracious for you to be concerned about us and and wish us well and all that so i am thankful for you guys beyond belief um it made me happy to know that you guys care um so i'm gonna this is the hobonichi kit this is a oopsie and you can see some of the foils messed up but it doesn't bother me i love to use our oopsies up and this is the um uh journal sheet for a reset this is still i believe yeah this is still in the shop i try not to i try only to do plan with me's with stuff that you can still purchase um, but we have been taking a lot of stuff out of the shop as we're kind of revamping a few things. So I'm just going to start with put, putting the washi down. And so last, was it Saturday? Friday? Um, Thursday? Oh, Friday maybe. This fr I can't... Um, I can't remember. I have to look back at my planner, but um, Emily wasn't feeling well, and um, she is a manager at a bank. She used to be with DEK, 
and she decided to um, go out on her own and pursue her what she got her degree in and she went into banking she's been in banking before she loves it and she got offered a um, manager position close to the close to our area here so um, she's around customers they come in her office all day long anyway um, she started feeling ill and um, she went right away and got um, the rabbit test and it came back positive so um, she immediately, you know, didn't go to work and quarantined, but she does live here with us. She lives in the basement, um, but we see her every day, you know, we're, um, pretty active in all of our kids' lives. So, um, let's see, where do I... I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna start with my boxes and I'm gonna put them down here. Um, so, uh, a few days later, Mark and I started getting symptoms and we've been vax and boosted <coughs> and all of that. Um, so it started off with just like really, um, really itchy eyes and a sore throat and, um, so anyway, we both ended up getting it too. And Katie, who works here every day, did not get it, um, as soon as we found out about Emily and Emily was home, um, we sent Katie home and with her laptop and iPad and all that and just said, work from home. We don't need you getting sick as well. So, um... Yeah, so we both got it, and all three of us had totally, well, I wouldn't say totally, some of the symptoms were the same, but, <coughs> um, we had, um, different symptoms. Uh, Mark was, um, um, he had a lot more congestion um, than I did. He lost his uh, taste and smell. I did not. I lost some of it, but not all of it. And um, um Oh, I don't know what I was thinking. Anyway, it was funny how our symptoms were all different. Emily was very exhausted, very congested, high fever for like seven days. And Mark and I were with the fever and all that. Well, Mark didn't have a fever. I had a fever. Emily had a fever. Um... We're only maybe because we got boosted, and you know, um, but we it seemed like forever, but we uh were sick for what five days, six days. I don't know. Today's the end of our um quarantine, we're feeling better. I haven't had a fever in over 24 hours. So, um, I'm just going to work on the sidebar now. 
so yeah we're ready to rock and roll again thank you all for waiting and being so patient with us um something that you know out of our control and we run a really tight very strict schedule here um to keep things moving <clears throat> you know because not only do we have our orders but we have the mystery kit and we have this subscription um so it's constant we're on a strict schedule of what we do when so to lose all that time is uh I messed this up. This is supposed to be my meals. I have them due, but I don't want to walk over and get it. And then, see, talking. I can't do two things at the same time. <coughs> oh, sorry. That's gross. I'm sorry. And then this is, I always do this week. This is where I record my mood for the day, how I'm feeling. Okay. Um, and then I'm gonna keep on the sidebar before I hop into everything. Y'all know I don't, I like, I did there, I don't like the, um, the black showing there it's just a personal preference thing so <coughs> let me use some of these sorry guys oh that's crooked <laughs> Yeah, I'm just going to do that. <clears throat> I'm going to trim it. Oh, that's really pretty. I like that. I'm going to, because I got that crooked, I am going to just put this right here, what I trimmed off, and that covers that up. Oh, that's pretty. Okay, and then I'm, I always use the corner pieces here. Creature of habit. Um, and I'm actually, I think I'm gonna, um, I did pull out And I have them ready. Um, I have it marked with a clip. What stickers I think I'm going to use this week. And I think I'm going to put this uh, Remember um, the 1099s. I think that, that green around, I don't know. Even the tan looks okay, or the gray. That's not the right color green. <clears throat> okay, I'm just gonna use this lighter gray here. I'm gonna put that right here at a diagonal. And while I'm thinking about it, I'm gonna write 1099s. And I'm going to put a few pieces of the deco. Let's see. These are nice big deco pieces. Let's use this one. I'm sorry, I'm off camera. That is so pretty. And. Let's use this one and cut off the bottom. 
Let's see if we can actually maybe use that somewhere else. Okay, I just had my scissors. Where'd they go? Are they go? <laughs> Crazy. I don't know if that'll be of much use, so I'm just gonna stick that back there. <clears throat> so the sidebar is done. It is really pretty. I grabbed out this washi. Um, I think it's from Simply Gilded from quite a quite a long time ago when I used to get their sub. Probably three, four years ago, but. Um, I thought I could incorporate some of this maybe. Um, but yeah. So let's see, Monday. I mean, we're gonna be heavy on orders all week, but I'm gonna put this girl. <clears throat> I'm actually gonna. <clears throat> Use a little swatch here and layer Chloe on here, which Chloe, we just took her out of the shop because we're converting everything over to Emma as um, Katie has time to do that. Um, and I'm going to put it. Should I do that? No. <clears throat> struggling here guys <laughs> I'm just going to use this little thing to do the 1099's And I'm going to use this piece of um, washi to note that I will be on orders all day long. Um, all week, all day. <laughs> but I'm going to really make it stand out on Monday. Um, this is just a washi card that we had in one of our sub boxes. I think uh, it was our October box, if I'm remembering right. Put this back on here, probably use more. Okay, <clears throat> on Tuesday, I have oh I know what I need to mark down Monday I want to wash our bedding you know after being sick you just want to get everything really clean <laughs> so I'm gonna mark that with just like a one of these well I'm very indecisive <laughs> I'm gonna use this And wash bedding. Do I want that? No. I'm going to use Emma. I'm going to use Emma instead. Um, drowning in laundry. But I'll know that's our... We have a lot of laundry to do too, but I, I know I need to do the bedding. Okay, Wednesday. I do this on Wednesdays and on Fridays, but I, I'm not sure we're gonna have a hump day this week. I it really, I have some items ready for it, but I don't think we're going to be ready. It, it depends on how much we get done. I don't want to be overwhelmed 
and get more backed up than what we already are. If that makes sense. I was, there's just some foil missing there on this little oopsie thing, so I was going to put a little floral on top of that because it's kind of bothering me. Uh, yeah. Um, Tuesday, I have to order supplies. I gotta get our foil order in. So I'm gonna do one of these. Uh, little stamps. And my order supply icon. Uh, Tuesday night, I want to wash my hair. So, and another Emma. I just think she's so cute. I just, there's just something about her that's just a little bit cuter than Chloe. And I love that we're doing in our, her in the colors. All of her colors are the same colors as um, this. Very neutral to go with any spread. Um, so I have order supplies and then wash hair. I'll be orders all day long. a little bit of this <sighs> sorry my nose is running a little bit <clears throat> I really like the contrasting black with this kit. It's really pretty. And I don't think there's anything else big on Tuesday. Wednesday, I'm not sure if we're gonna have hump day. So I'm just gonna leave this here in case we do. So if we do, I'll put the name of the kit in there. If not, I'll find another use for that box. Okay. <clears throat> I'm going to put one of these header strips here just to signify the the end of that task, so to speak. And then I need a little piece of deco or something. Oh, I'm going to use this divider. This is a floral divider under our foil section. And it's a standard size, so it's going to overlap a little bit. <coughs> Excuse me. Wednesday. It'll be orders and all that again. But... I am gonna just put a little decorative piece here. And then a box. <clears throat> With another Chloe. And this is going to be packing orders. We have a lot that is going to be shipping out. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, and we have a, 
I will do my grocery order on Wednesday because I did it. Uh, I didn't even mark it down. It's in my daily. I haven't transferred everything over. Um, grocery. Let's use this watercolor splash. Um, Mark's actually excited to go to the grocery store because he hasn't been out of the house. I'm used to not leaving the house. I hardly ever leave the house. Um, but he's excited to go to the grocery store. He wants to go today. Um, yeah, so <laughs> we had groceries brought in last week and then we ordered out soup and stuff for delivery. I mean, it was okay. Neither one of us felt like cooking. Um, so yeah, we ordered a lot of soup in. Okay, Thursday, Thursday. I have to do design work. <clears throat> so I want to maybe start that at like two. I just so you guys know, I do my design work in the evening. I work on orders every single day. And I might I do my designs in the evening when I'm sitting on my recliner. <coughs> it's a nice break to be away from the office and the cutting machines. So that is gonna be design day. And I I thought I grabbed my design icons. But I guess I didn't. Uh, I guess not. Huh. That's okay. We'll write it in. Excuse me for just a second. Sorry about that. <laughs> okay. We're going to write in design. I should have spread out the Chloe's a little bit more because I didn't, I didn't bring any more over. Uh, that's all right. <laughs> I don't want to pause the video again, guys. I don't want it to be too long for you. So just going to layer a couple these and write in orders and then use the last of my black strip of washi here Oops, <laughs> Lord. Uh. Okay. <clears throat> and I'm going to put this down here. And A deco. I'm gonna use this big tall one here. 
I think that'll fit in there nicely. And then I can record something there. Fridays, it's going to be orders and da da da, but um, I do. have to film for the following week. How do I want to mark that? I want to do a corner piece and overlay this film script. Sorry if you can hear that. My husband's upstairs sneezing. Okay. <clears throat> and I still have some boxes here, so I'm going to use those. layering with the octagons <clears throat> Saturday oh I forgot to put my weekend banner down I'll just put it right here So I think that our sticker paper that we normally use, that we've used for several years now, will be back in stock soon. <clears throat> so I'm excited about that, but I'm also curious what you guys think about that. Do you like our old sticker paper better or do you like the Mohawk better? Let me know in the comments below, please. I'm going to put a header here just to kind of balance that out because there's pretty much something up on top on every day. I still don't like how that looks. That's all right. It's all right. <laughs> okay. I'm going to do a pretty floral here. And I'm going to use this last journal box here. Oh, well, it's more centered. And a splasher. with another floral. And then I don't, <clears throat> I have a corner and I have flat bugs. So I'm gonna use a flag over here. I'm gonna put it on this side just to balance that column out a little bit more. And then I'm gonna put the other color one down here uh, <clears throat> let's use this corner piece over here yeah I still have four florals yet left that I want to use. So I'm going to put one down here. There's still room to put an icon if I want. And right here, <clears throat> maybe put one here. Oh, 
I like that better. Um, one in here somewhere. Hmm, no, I don't like that. How about this regular? That looks okay. And I have one left. I was thinking maybe putting it here. But there's that floral down there. But that's where I'm going to put it. I'll put it on this side. Yeah. Just trim off this. And then I'm going to put a new release <coughs> sticker over there. Oh, I got a rose gold. Do I have any other film, film, new release? That's rose gold. I'm just going to use the rose gold that I pulled. It's fine. So, for sure, new releases on that day. Okay, so what I have left, I have a flag left, and I got three headers, and I got these script headers. I still have couple boxes but I don't need them and I use this entire page except for two hexagons that's pretty good so I am gonna just bougie up my deco pieces a little bit um, I like to take either our header overlays or our um, um, uh, full over confetti overlay boxes or underlays, bougie boxes, whatever you want to call them. But I'm just going to use this today and I just take, take the strip and cut off little pieces and put it on the deco. On the journaling pieces. It just adds a little extra bling. It's not the same as having the kit foiled because you know it is the overlay, but it works for me on the deco pieces for sure. So I'm just gonna put one This one doesn't have much bling on it. Um, put one on each of the florals. It's a great way to use up any um, extra overlays that you have laying around in your stash. My stash is getting pretty... Um, overflowing. I need to do a um, de-stash giveaway in our Facebook group. I haven't done one of those for a while. As soon as I'm all caught up and a little more energetic, I will have to do that. piece. Can't forget this one. This one doesn't really need one because it's got this on top of it. So. <clears throat> 
see just that little extra bling. Um, let's put our date dots on quick so it's all complete. So 31st. An Olympic start. I should mark that. <clears throat> I like watching the skating for sure. What else is in the Winter Olympics? We usually watch like the bobsledding and the the skating and this and the ski jumps and oh, that's just pretty. I should mark that in here or below it or Olympics. I wrote it in there. I'm really trying to get my handwriting better, but it's a struggle. So I never use this. Don't need it. I think it looks great just like it is. Um, I did, I think I said I was going to show you some of my daily pages, so I'm sorry, but let's flip through the last few daily pages. I think I stopped showing you guys around here. So... Oh yeah, the winter storm. I just love looking back in my planner. This was using the sub box. It's very pretty. Oh, that's when we ship the sub boxes out. Oh, that was the Packer game. And that's when we started. Or was it sent? Yeah, that's when we told um, the other kids that nobody could come over for the game. Everyone's huge Packer fans here. And they lost, so I had some smearing going on here. It must have been a different pen than my fountain pen or something. Um... Yeah. COVID closed the shops. Yeah, we had Applebee's. Um, what did we have from? We had some kind of soup from Applebee's. Soup from Jason's Deli. Mark was really. Tuesday was a bad day for him. Uh, yeah, order foil. Never did that. I did do my yearly and I did work on the settings, which was actually over in the week as well. So that makes me happy. <coughs> Thursday, I pretty much slept all day. Well, slept like tried to sleep. <laughs> I had a hard time sleeping. Even the NyQuil wouldn't knock me out. Um... Yeah, this is our Alpine kit. I think it's still in the shop. And then 
the sub box spots open that day. I didn't record anything else. Yeah. So there you have it. Um, that is for the week of the 31st in my Hobonichi cousin, the weekly overview. Thank you for watching. <clears throat> I'll link the kit below. Sorry, <clears throat> losing my voice. Um, I'll link the kit below and, um, we will see you soon. Look for new releases on Sunday. Not sure about hump day. Appreciate you guys very much. Stay healthy. Bye.